Make myself here a coffee for this morning, I am. Okay, we're gonna make yourself a little coffee. I already had half a coffee, but I gotta have a full coffee because I gotta take some stuff. But the reason why I come on today is one reason only. Well, more than one reason. How you doing, by the way? Hopefully everybody's doing good like me. I'm doing okay now, somewhat. Do you believe me? I wouldn't. So I've decided to uh, switch things up a little bit around here. I'm going to... Actually, I don't want to open that. It's hot out today and it's cool in here. I'm going to sell the trailer. I don't use the trailer that much anymore. The daughter's getting older. She don't want to go camping. Stacy doesn't want to go camping or when she does, it's a big hassle. So I'm done with that thing. I'm thinking about selling the truck too. I'm not sure yet, but we're still thinking about that. But the trailer is going to go for sure. But we're having to pick something else up here. And I want like a mobile office kind of, you know, a new project. I haven't had a new project since the truck. And you know me and my projects. If I don't have a project, I sit around and just mope, which a lot of us probably do sit around and mope, but we gotta stop doing that. So my good old buddy there at TC Tune, Trevor Couture and uh, Corey from Velocity Codex, got myself a little, you remember that from one of my videos from a long time ago. We got ourselves a little van here. I started work on down here a little bit we got to put a patch right there. we got to put a patch there. And that's it on the whole van. The rest of her is solid. But we're going to turn this thing into a camper, I think. They started to work on the inside a little bit. Not much. Took the walls out. Starting to take the walls down. It's all metal. We had some rats and mice in there or something, but we're going to get rid of that. We're going to re-insulate this whole thing. Maybe put a divider wall up here somewhere. So I can put my batteries, my solar panels, and my propane tank all back in here. And then from there forward, we'll uh, put a kitchen and maybe a little desk over here. And then a fold down bed or something. That's what I think we're going to do. But she's already got a swap in her. She's been... Oh. She's been 5'3 swap, she has. I am tight for height, as you can see. So once I get the wood on, I might have to walk with a little bit of a hunch. But that's okay. A little bit of hunch won't hurt. You only walk down the middle normally and then you sit, so we should be fine. She's got the LS53 in her with a uh, 4L80E transmission. So this thing's gonna be LS powered. This engine was running. It's gotta be wired. I got a harness in the back of my truck that I'm not looking forward to working on, but that's the first thing we gotta do is get this thing running. We gotta get her running. She's got new brake lines, new front brakes, Everything else is pretty good. The only thing I am concerned when I look down here is this manifold is touching the frame, which is no good unless this engine solid mount, which I can't tell right now. So we're gonna have to maybe put some different kind of headers on there or something, because that's no good against a frame like that. It's gonna bust something. That side's okay, but this side touchy touch. So maybe we'll put some shorty headers on her. We'll make sure we get that out of the way. But this is going to be a long project. This ain't going to be no short project. Trevor put some nice comfy seats in here. Look at them bad boys, hey? We'll get them all hooked up so they're power. Friggin' right we will, maybe. I don't know, maybe they won't work power anymore. Oh, uh, yeah, maybe they would. Maybe get them hooked up, get some power into them. Should be pretty cool. Thinking about painting her all white. I got a few patches down here we got to do. We got to do a few, couple patches somewhere else too. There and over there and other than that, not too bad, eh? But she's a step van. She's a 19 something something step van. She is Chevy 30. How you doing? Yep, she's going to be a little bit of a project. I'm going to use the solar panels from my shed, from a garage over here. We're going to put them on this thing. So that will give me solar power. Gotta get some new lights, maybe put paint it all white with trim clad, eh? And then maybe we'll put on their uh, bills of security. Keep her stealth. That way you can park wherever you want and somebody thinks it's a work vehicle. What the hell kind of fly is that little bastard? Freak. That's a new breed. Oh. Oh, what the hell? Gotta learn how to work a door too, obviously. But leave any comments down below about that. Leave any comments down below about whether you've done a conversion or not. And leave any comments down below if you wanna see something like that. So this is just a short little video to tell you we got a new project in the house. We'll get started on that.
probably as soon as the trailer goes for sale i gotta do a couple things on the trailer first i gotta replace the leds because they don't work and i gotta fix a few things because i want a return key so when whoever gets her she's ready to go so yeah just a quick little video update here what's going on over here maybe go for a scooter ride later on we're not going to do the live thing again because as you know in the last video it was just horrible that was one of the worst live streams i think i've ever done so sorry about putting you through that suffering i'm going to go pro with the next one and then i'm going to edit it so you get just see the good parts let me know if you want to see that but anyways until the next one i'm going to take off here and i'll be back